Hi friends. Welcome to 30 Inks 30 Days Day 7. Uh, may have to pause briefly because I have a kettle on, but I'm raring to go. So as usual, we're going to look at day six now that it's all dried. That was again Rider's Blood in this Pelican M205 in Moonstone. Here's a splat. If I hold it at an angle in the grazing light, maybe you can see this, that there's like almost a, a black halo around it. And our grid to date. Loving this. Although the cranberry twinkle looks so out of place because there, that's a little better. So that's shimmer. That was yesterday. Today, turn the page, and we're going with Diamine Red Dragon, and I am putting that in my um, Platinum 3776. This is the... Nice Pure. I'm assuming it's Nice because I think the set seemed to have um, Cities in Paris as the names. So we will write the name on our chromatography paper. And then also... Oh, kettle and rinsing this out. <laughs> Be right back. Uh, here we are. Raring to go. That is too much ink. Doing really well at making sure I get my utilities worth out of this uh, freezer paper, huh? <laughs> yeah, let's turn this in. Watch the ink right there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. pretty well saturated I hope now close it up dab it up um, I bought this uh, ink a while ago because I was like well everyone needs a red ink obviously this will be mine I sampled a bunch and I still am pleased with this as a red ink I have almost never used it uh, <laughs> Turns out maybe everyone needs a red ink, but I don't use mine much. Oh, look. That was out of here. Boop, boop, boop. That looks like... <laughs> you hear my timer? That's for my cup of tea. Let's go get that. All right, maybe that was enough time for the ink to flow. Hey, it was. I said that fully expecting it not to be. So let's get going. So September 7th is a special day for me. It's my brother's birthday. Um, sometimes I think I should throw him a party, um, but like, Maybe that's kind of morbid. <laughs> oh, no, it's my brother who's dead. Um, 
If it was a living brother, I don't think it'd be morbid to throw him a party. <laughs> um, okay. So, um, let me know what you think. Do you think that's morbid and weird? Maybe morbid and weird, but still worth doing anyway. Um, my friend Cal commented that he cringed a bit when he saw me write the two year, two digit year. I also remember those days. Oh, wow. The chromatography for this is amazing. Um, spoilers. I hope you'll notice it's four digits there. When I send letters to people, it's always four digits. Um, perfect, perfect. You can see in this a little bit what you can see in this amazing chromatography. Now, there is a touch of blue there. It's possible that that blue is from the converter. But maybe not. So anyway, yellowy with some red. I think this would have gone even further if I had let it. Uh, I feel a little bit like a charlatan. I'm filming this fairly well in advance because um, reasons. But I, it's worth noting that even though I film this in advance, I do still use these pens on the day. So... Um, for my nightly journal, for my random thoughts and whining journal, on the on the calendar day, it's the only pen I use. So that makes me feel a little bit more okay about it. I like this. This this right here looks like crime scene. Reddit is always recommending. Um, Ox blood to people. Reddit is wrong. It's Red Dragon. I'm just gonna point that out. Red Dragon is is if you're getting a diamine, I think this is the red. And I'm tempted to, to do this right now. So my plans for this morning are to drink my cup of tea and then investigate um, the weather and some hiking trails over in Point Reyes, which to me is evident from the name, but maybe not to you, next to the water. I believe there's a lighthouse there. Um... It's supposed to be hot today, but I think not in my area. Like, I live in this weird valley that I should be happy. I should be happy that it's not reaching triple digits, but I love the heat, and here we are. Time makes fools of us all. The nails have lasted still. Um, also, if you see this pink, that's just hair color coming off onto my hands so no no fancy writing just writing okay um I got a headache today 
you go. Twitch a little bit. The reason I'm okay with this is because it's unlikely that I will be filling this book the next time a 22 rolls around. Friend asked why I do these little figure eights like this. I'm pushing harder slightly on the downstrokes. Um, and so that lets me see if this has any give or flex. These I do to get a feel for how the nib feels in each of those directions and also is one of them appreciably um, wetter or drier and you can see it is the downstrokes are definitely laying down the most ink so red dragon wrote after I landed on, after some searching, I landed on this as my perfect red. So here we are, here is today, day seven for 30 inks, 30 days in September, 2022. What do you think? And also, do you see anything in these splats? I don't think I do splats as thorough as um, Manda's, so mine don't usually look like much. Um, also, I should shout out, I've been including this in the description box below my video, but um, there's some other great folks doing uh, 30 Inks 30 Days here on YouTube, so please check them out. I've got Miss Marilyn Darling, uh, Manda ink splat man to be and the dormouse's desk and they're all doing slightly different things and it's pretty great to see in my opinion uh so uh check those lovely folks out and thanks for hanging out with me and i will see you again soon bye